If your partner consistently engages in disrespectful, dishonest, domineering, or unsupportive behaviors, your relationship can be toxic. A toxic relationship is what? In a happy marriage, everything just sort of clicks. Sure, you might argue occasionally or encounter other hiccups, but generally speaking, you make decisions together, honestly enjoy each other's company, and communicate any issues that come up. The issue of toxic relationships is another. Relationship therapist Jor L. Caraballo claims that in a toxic relationship, you could frequently feel exhausted or sad after spending time with your partner, which may be a sign that something has to change. Despite the fact that you still adore your partner, the relationship might not feel at all joyful right now. You two always seem to get on each other's nerves or can't seem to stop bickering over insignificant things. Instead of anticipating seeing them like you once did, you could even fear the notion of it. Before starting the video do not forget to like share subscribe and comment. What indicate a relationship is toxic? According to Carla Marie Manley, PhD, author of, Joy from Fear, toxicity symptoms can range from being hardly perceptible to being quite prominent, depending on the nature of the connection. It may not always be simple for you to recognize the warning signs that a relationship is poisonous when they begin to appear. However, some of these symptoms may be present in you, your spouse, or the relationship itself. 1. A lack of backing. According to Caraballo, healthy relationships are built on a shared desire to see the other thrive in all areas of life. But when conditions deteriorate, every accomplishment turns into a contest. In other words, it doesn't feel good to be with you anymore. They don't make you feel encouraged or supported, and you can't rely on them to stand up for you. Instead, you can feel as though they only care about what they want and don't care about your wants or interests. 2. Harmful communication. Most of your talks are characterized by sarcasm or criticism and heated by contempt, as opposed to warmth and respect for one another. Do you ever notice yourself making rude comments to friends or family? When they're in another room, you might ridicule them by mockingly repeating what they said. To avoid the ensuing conflicts and antagonism, you can simply start avoiding their calls. 3. Jealousy or envy. Even though it's acceptable to feel a little jealousy every now and again, Caraballo warns that it can become problematic if your jealousy prevents you from appreciating your partner's accomplishments. The same is true of envy. It is a completely normal human emotion, yes. However, when it results in ongoing mistrust and suspicion, your relationship may start to fast deteriorate. 4. Containing habits. Does your lover frequently inquire as to where you are? Maybe when you don't respond to their texts right away or when they keep texting you until you do, they get agitated or annoyed. These actions may be motivated by jealousy or a lack of trust, but they may also reflect a need for control, both of which can exacerbate the toxicity of a relationship. These control attempts occasionally may also point to abuse. Indignation 5. Intimacy is harmed by holding on to grudges and allowing them to fester. Over time, frustration or resentment can build up and make a smaller chasm much bigger. Whether you tend to keep your complaints to yourself because you don't feel comfortable raising them in public. Your relationship can be poisonous if you can't rely on your partner to hear your worries. 6. Deception. Whether it's to avoid spending time with your spouse or because you're concerned about how they'll react if you disclose the truth. You find yourself making up lies about your whereabouts and who you meet up with all the time. 7. Disrespectful tendencies. A warning sign is being consistently late, nonchalantly, forgetting, events, and other actions that demonstrate contempt for your time, according to Manley. Remember that some people may actually struggle to make and adhere to commitments on time, so starting with a discussion about this behavior may be helpful. If it's not deliberate, after you explain why it upsets you, things might become better. 8. Poor financial practices. A degree of agreement about how you'll spend or save your money is typically required when you share your finances with a spouse. However, if one partner decides to spend money on things that the other partner disapproves of, the relationship is not inherently toxic. However, it can be toxic if you and your partner have made financial agreements and one party repeatedly disregards those agreements whether by making expensive purchases or making excessive cash withdrawals. 9. Persistent anxiety. Of course, 
regular life obstacles like a family member's illness or a job loss can cause some friction in your relationship. But being on edge all the time, even when no external stressors are present, is a telltale sign that something is wrong. Your physical and mental health may suffer as a result of this persistent stress, and you may regularly feel miserable, physically and emotionally drained, or otherwise ill. Like, share, subscribe and press the bell icon.